Good evening and welcome back once again. So if you joined us last time, we had the second match in our first season of Division 1 and we got a 1-1 and we deserved at least a draw but we didn't play great and we ended up scoring quite late on so you know we'll take a point in that situation what we'll do is we've got a game against sporting today we'll just jump straight into uh, the team selection and, and what team have decided to play today okay so i think this is the lineup we're going to go with a few changes to our sort of traditional starting 11 back five as, as normal we are bringing in joe linton for bruno and we've got reino on the left just because they're on red ups. Uh, Brian Hill is also on a, a slight up as is sent maximum. I'm gonna leave him for now, probably bring them off the bench. And again, Bellingham, he'll probably get a go of being on an up there as well. But um, yeah, I think we'll just jump straight into the action. And here we go, we're off. So like I say, if you did watch the last match, um, or if you didn't, rather, it was a bit of a disappointing game in a way, or nearly was. Um, we were so close to losing the game that we had so many chances on. Oh, wonderful ball, and geez, that was some clearance. Um, I nearly dropped... Oh, what a chance from uh, from I say. I mean, it wasn't a great chance. It was just a great shot. Oh, just wide. That would have been a goal of the month job there. But yeah, we nearly thought about dropping Almiron for Brian Hill, being both sort of left footers on the attack midfielder side. Um, but, you know, Almiron is such a good player. Um, and Brian Hill's more one for the future. And he, he will get games this season, clearly. But... Um, yeah, I think we need to go in with a with a strong lineup today. Um, it's, it's finding that balance of yes, you want to improve your younger players, but you also need to win the matches that you've got now. Um, nice ball through to Isaac there. It's not really anyone in support. There is now. Oh, Jolinton just couldn't get to that. Bouncing around a bit. Nice tackle from Botman there. Oh, Liao's in here. Oh, just over. It's such a difficult angle. I just thought, I don't know how I'm going to beat the keeper. Just blast it. Uh, hit it over, though. Yeah, sometimes I'm... And I'm not sure how to improve it, but sometimes there is a lack of support. Oh, but here we go, Isaac. Ah, oh, just a heavy touch. Can Bottom get there first? He can, just about. And that's a bit of a risky pass there. And again, there wasn't really much support. Just had to hit it at the goalkeeper and hope we got to squeeze it by him. Oh, here's Armand though. Armand, no. I mean, those are like a one or two in ten on the really. Well, we're halfway through this, uh, this first half, and we've been the better of the team, but not any completely clear-cut chances. A lot of them have been from narrow angles and not really much support, but we're looking pretty good at the moment. Not a great ball. He is dest very quick. Now Almiron. What can Almond do now? Oh, he runs into traffic. 
good header, header from Guardiola there. He's been really impressive in the World Cup. I know um, that's a foul. Uh, which match was it? It was when they played Belgium, um, put in a last ditch sort of block against Lukaku, who should have scored a few goals in that game. Um, yeah, he's been playing really well. And okay, don't know how that's a free kick to us, but I'll take it. Oh, a bit white arm on, but got a chance to get a ball in here. Isaac, there it is, 1 0. Almon thought about going for the shot again, but he played the simple ball and Isaac slotted it away. So, Almon's looks like our most dangerous player, so I think the fact that we did choose to start him has been a very, very good choice. That just takes the pressure off ourselves a little bit. Um, you know, Sporting are probably going to have to be a bit more attacking now. They really haven't been so far. Or well, we haven't let them. It's a poor pass. And Cabral is somehow injured. I don't know if that was a hamstring, was it? Or, or was that the foul from earlier? Um, and again, I didn't actually press tackle there but he did got away with it what could have got a yellow card there oh Davies is fast Isaac could be in here oh I thought I got my shirt pulled a little bit Isaac, oh 2-0, what a header that was, wow, that was some goal, I mean Davies looks so dangerous on the left, I'm, I'm so happy we managed to get him, great ball but look at this header from Isaac, Shiva will be proud, wow. What I was thinking of doing as well is that the, I, I didn't think too far ahead on season one and I wish I had of, but I was thinking of doing like a, a season a season highlight of just the goals. So, you know, when we finished season two, um, just have a fairly short video. Oh, what a header that was as well. Um, wasn't concentrating there, but that's a really good header. Disappointed with that. We like keeping our clean sheets. Got to do better though on the left. Nice header. But yeah, we're thinking of doing that sort of um, like a short highlights video, maybe with some background music, you know, without me talking. Um, just of all the goals, but I do have to. Ooh. Maybe I should stop talking. Um, yeah, we'll pick up that conversation in the second half. I think we'll just jump straight back in. But yeah, about the season highlights, I, I just didn't think about ahead and it would mean... Because what I do is when I've edited and... Well, recorded and edited the video, I obviously then upload them to YouTube, do all of that. Um, and I do keep the videos for a little bit until they go live, make sure everything is fine, and then I'll delete them. Um, so to get those highlights again, I would either have to maybe download the, the videos. Um, and I just thought we might as well start afresh through season two. So what I'm going to do now is, I haven't done it yet, um, but I'll start sort of cutting out the goals in a separate sort of file or something. Joel Linton now. Oh, good tackle. Should have done better though, really. Oh, that's a good tackle. Surely got the ball there. Yep, 
his armor on again. Run into trouble though. Des looking for the ball out and there wasn't really anyone in a good position but I did dwindle on it too long good tackle from Isaac maybe in our star player today along with Almiron Joel Linton loses out again though good block Oh, what is going on there? An absolute scramble. Poor defending. And it's back level. I thought I got lucky there, but there's just no one reacted in time. Oh, wow. I'll tell you what, we're definitely going to make some changes here. As you can see, I'm bringing on Bellingham. Brian Hill and St. Maxman going off his Almor and Joel Leighton and Liao. Now, Almor's played well, but we need some fresh legs. Joel Leighton's, he's on and up, but he's given the ball away so many times and haven't really seen much of Liao. So, St. Maxman's going to go up top. We'll see what difference that makes. Yeah, we really need to get them out there at them now. Really did think maybe I laxed off a little bit, but did think when we went 2-0 up that that's pretty much game set and match oh Dest I'm not sure if I should have passed or not when he'll take the ball oh what happened there is that a corner no did we just miss the chance there I think That was meant for St. Maximum, but it gets it back anyway. Ah, just couldn't quite keep it in. The, the ball out wide wasn't great. I managed to keep it in just about. Um, ooh, get him. Isaac does get it. St. Maximum, there he is. The substitutions work, but Isaac once again causing trouble. Nearly got the ball back once, did the second time. Wonderful play down the wing and very unselfish. Plays a beautiful ball across and set maximum there for the tap in. Well, I've got plenty of goals today. Uh, another entertainment match. St. Maximum overruns it, but he gets it back. St. Maximum, no, well wide. Good match to watch, though. I'd rather have a, a, a 2 or 3 nil uh, win, but um, St. Maximum in again. Just couldn't find the right angle. Bellingham. Brian Hill. Bellingham. Oh, hits the post. Bellingham again. Oh, it's just not going for us there, is it? Oh. Should have had the game tied up there, but... I would say we're a bit unlucky. St. Maxima, I thought he might be an offside there, but now Brian Hill, breaking in from the right. Ah, just overrun it. I cannot believe this game. 3-3 three, three now. What is going on? I 
just couldn't get it away. Good save, but... Ah, oh, it's poor defendant. My goodness. It's all going off today. Oh, lovely ball to Brian Hill. Say Maximan again! <laughs> it's 4-3, <laughs> what's going on? Oh my god. Wow. Try to play the ball through, came off the keeper. I don't know if that'll count as an assist, probably not. But the subs are paying off. <sighs> Just do not let in another goal. Defensively, we're being shocking today. Oh, a nice ball. Touch and ball from Bellingham. Isaac, has he still got the legs? He has. Bellingham, there it is, and it's five. Another sub <laughs> making a difference. Wow. I mean, this is, a, it's gonna take some going to beat this goal record. Eight goals in this game so far. Sorry, I just skipped the highlights there. Um, the replay rather. Still got a few minutes left, but I would say the game's safe. Doesn't mean we're not gonna let in another goal. Um, And we get a six. Not a hat trick for St. Maximum, surely. Isaac! Oh, he hits the post at the bar. Oh, that was for the hat trick. Oh, and there it is. Nope. I thought that was full time. I don't know how that was a free kick, but there we go. And there it is. Full time. What a game. 5-3. Um, we did deserve to win, but we had some shocking moments in defence. I mean, just looking at the game records, 8.5 for Isaac, which in Pez games... That is an extremely high score, especially in Pessex. You know, normally if you get seven and a half, eight, that's a very, very good performance. Not sure what's wrong with the rating systems, but they've always been like that. Um, but I wouldn't disagree. I would say Almoron probably deserves better than six and a half. He was magnificent um, for the 60 or so minutes he played. Say maximum 7.5, yeah, and all the subs made a difference. So six and a half, probably it deserves sevens really. Um, Liao 5.5 I would agree Rainer didn't really do much yeah um, Defence didn't play that well so I, maybe these should have been a bit lower um, but the wing backs did well so yeah really exciting game but yes thank you very much for joining once again if you could leave a like maybe put a comment down below what you thought of the video or any suggestions about players to sign in the future any other games you would like to see. I do play mainly PES 6 and PGA Tour 2K23 at the moment, but I have got some other games in mind. But like I say, leave some suggestions below. Thank you very much for joining, and I'll speak to you all soon.